Welcome to the tutorial video which is explain uh, how to restore configuration on a steelhead using CMC. Uh, we have a new device which came uh, to us and we would like to deploy it into our network. Uh, the previously um, used steelhead was managed by the CMC so we have configuration on this device. So I will log into the device using the console uh, cable. Uh, I need to set exactly the same IP on a primary interface as previously used on the steelhead. Which is 10, 63, 64, 31 and I cover it with a uh, 24 bit mask. IP was set. I will write it to the memory and now uh, let's see how CMC uh, is seeing this steelhead. So I have CMC which uh, previously had managed this uh, device. Uh, I go to the home tab and what I see, I see that my device is connected. So that's the IP which we set on a primary interface. The name is Amnesiac uh, because the device was uh, not configured previously. And uh, what is interesting, we have a st uh, status of the device critical and it says that the serial number is reported by the appliance doesn't match the serial number previously used by this appliance, uh, which is the uh, expected situation. So what I do, I will go to manage appliances page, uh, I will expand status of the device by ma clicking on the magnifying glass. I will go to appliance utility tab and I will update the serial number. By the fact that I'm updating the serial number I'm also uh, restoring the state or rather migrating the state of the of the device previously used. So right now uh, as you see the update uh, of the serial number was done. The appliance is connected and healthy. I can see the operation history and uh, the operation history tells me that the state was migrated from one device to the other or either from one serial uh, number to the other. What I can do uh, further down, I can uh, go to the appliance backup and restore. I can choose my appliance which I have over here in the drop down list. I have the backups over here previously done. I migrated this device before uh, just uh, to make this uh, video more smooth. So I will choose uh, this backup, I will, I will click on it, so I will check if for example my IP addresses on the impact interface, IP address on the primary interface match, I can see more or less the, um, the configuration of the device and then I can restore the configuration of the de this device. So that's what I'm going to do. The configuration will be restored. We can check it on the operation history. So you see the user backup backup restored to the device. Uh, we can check it on the operation history, so restore of the backup is completed successfully and uh, we can check uh, on my home page of the CMC that uh, my device with 31 in the last octet IP has a new name which is uh, the branch, steelhead branch 1 uh, which was previously backup. Thank you very much for your attention. I hope that this video um, will be helpful for you. Uh, this video is supplement uh, to the KB uh, S15295, which is explaining all of the process, uh, and you can find it by browsing the knowledge base of Riverbed. Goodbye.